Good morning children. In this video, we will be talking about excretion. Children, this is the last topic of life processes. In, we have already discussed about nutrition, transportation and respiration. So here we are focusing on excretion in animals that is human beings and in plants. This slide shows diagram of excretory system in human beings. What is excretion? Excretion is removal of waste from the body. This waste is formed due to a number of metabolic activities in the body. For example, carbon dioxide produced during respiration and ammonia produced as a result of metabolism of proteins and amino acids in, in human beings. Human beings, they have well-defined excretory system. Excretory system is made up of one pair of kidneys, one pair of ureters, a urinary bladder and urethra. A human being has one pair of kidneys. Kidneys are reddish brown bean shaped structure which are 10 cm long, 5 cm wide and thickness is 3 cm. Each kidney is connected with one tube like structure that is ureter which is 30 cm long and 4 mm in diameter. Both the ureters are opening in common bag like structure which is made up of muscles and it is known as urinary bladder. Urinary bladder is opening outside by urethra from where the waste is removed. Kidneys are made up of millions of small units, filtering units known as nephron. So this slide is structure and working of nephron. Each nephron has three parts. Cup-shaped bag-like structure, Wormann's capsule. Lower end of capsule is tubule. And clump of thin capillaries in capsule called glomerulus. In glomerulus, blood flows. Blood comes from renal artery. That is a front arteriole which brings blood from the body and it enters in the Bowman capsule through glomerulus and comes out by efferent arterioles. While crossing this Bowman capsule, filtrate collects in the Bowman capsule and moves in the tubules where important biomolecules are reabsorbed. So function of glomerulus is blood filtration and function of tubules, selectively reabsorption of important biomolecules that is glucose, amino acids, salt and water. These tubules are connected with the collecting duct which carry urine to the ureter. So this is all about the excretory system. Now excretion in plants. Children, plants also excrete gum, resin as a waste. Many of them are useful for us. So waste material may be stored in the cell vacuole or as gum and resin. Removed in the falling leaves or excreted in the surrounding soil. Excess water, by, uh, excess water is removed by plants by the process of transpiration. So this is all about excretion in human beings and in plants.